Greetings, I am Cross Knights, and it's time for that nice cling cling clang. Clang, the familiar Armor Games logo. This is Obliterate Everything, number two. It's quite a bit different than the first game, actually, but you know, also the same. There's definitely a progression. A lot of people liked this uh, game better when I was looking at reviews that were written around the time, because um, I guess a lot of people played this one first. I actually feel like, in some ways, I like the first one a little bit better. Well, you'll see the differences. Um, if you haven't seen my Obliterate Everything video, which is the first game in the series, don't worry about it. <laughs> it's not really necessary to watch this. They are pretty different games. You'll notice immediately that um, if you've seen the first one, there's not like just designated chapters. There is a map, and we're starting right here. There are different types of missions. This one is a duel. Difficulty zero. So that should be pretty easy. And I get rewarded. 50. 50 what? Well, those are upgrade points, but we don't need to worry about that quite now. We'll just start. I also will get barricades. So, tutorial. You are the blue team. Obliterate all other factions and dominate this sector of space. So we've got defensive items, ship items, and then energy items. All right, you build a ship, pay the energy costs, and the final array will automatically build ships. And we got, um, little things that can cause me to, you know, move better. And then they forced me to say skip this, even though I watched the entire thing. Where's my satisfying finish button tutorial? Oh, well. So, first we'll make a blaster. That'll shoot people. Unlike the first game, there is only one resource, and it is energy. So you can just generate energy with these. The other game had energy and mass. So that's already been streamlined. Then we have fighter bays. They work just like the first one. You click them and then you choose which type of fighter. Let's just use basic fighters for the time being. Now, they definitely made it easier to build things, because if I hold shift, I can uh, make a whole bunch of fighters or whatevers very easily. So, um, I mean, these don't seem to be producing. Are, are they? I guess they are. Some of them are. But yeah, they're, uh, they're going to attack the enemy base right there. Hmm. I mean, I couldn't really tell you why they're not all, uh... Why they're not... Oh, I, I see why. I didn't tell them to make fighters. When I made them, I screwed that up. Alright, so... I only thought I was telling them all to make fighters. Well, now they're all producing. When they were set before, they were not producing anything. So we are bombarding the enemy with a stream of tiny little fighters. And once that generator's gone, boom, over one, over, over run, oh god, <laughs> over one. So now I have barricades that will be added to my list, but I have to equip them, because you can't hold everything in this game, like in the other game. Barricades are for auxiliary, you can just set them up, they're little blocks in space, they'll intercept missiles and whatnot. Once you beat a stage, it will web off, and once you beat enough of the stages, you will get the final mission and you'll beat the game. I don't think I'm going to complete the entire map. When I was practicing, there was some stage I was unable to beat, but I was able to beat the game. So we'll see. I, there's certain ships I've never seen that I'd kind of like to show, but depends on how much effort I want to put in. So you can see how difficult the stage is by uh, the difficulty rating. Higher number, more difficult. It's kind of arbitrary at first, but that's all you need to know. Higher number, more difficult. That's not always true, though. There's certain missions that are just harder than other missions. So first, that should defend me. And I would, it would be better if I could make a gigantic reactor. They're bigger, they take up more space, and you only have a limited number of space around your base before you can not build anything. It's a lot easier to fill up that space in this game than it was in the other one. But there we go, there's a big reactor, gaining energy significantly faster. There's my enemy. You can click around the minimap to uh, go faster if you don't want to drag or use the Wazdas to fly around. But um, this time, I think I'm going to make... Interceptors. These are anti-fighter uh, things. They're not going to be that effective. You know, I, d I just kind of want to show different things off right now as opposed to actually carrying. But we'll uh, do that. I see how that happened before. Alright, so I haven't actually selected Interceptor in most of these. I was just building them really fast. At this stage, just building a bunch of ships into any stripe is just going to murder everything. Uh, they're equipped with missiles that specifically target ships usually, but they will also target other things if nothing else is around, so. 
They're already swarming everywhere, and I'm still making them while they're shooting things. It doesn't actually tell you how many ships you own at once, because it doesn't matter anymore. <laughs> There's no cap. So you can really swarm things. Remember to equip your turrets and other things also. Alright, so I want to do all of the, the low-level 11 uh, missions first. So static. Um, static can stun buildings, I believe. I should probably know that since I beat the game, but I don't really know that. Um, double buster, or blaster. This is the exact gun from the other game. Longer range, more damage, more cost. As opposed to, like, the short little blaster. So that should defend me for now. Yeah, he just died instantly. We got a ship right there. The biggest thing I would say that they changed is that you can't, um... You can't cheat by, like, building things in a really stupid way. Which is good. It was ridiculous that they allowed that, even though there are certain stages that I had no idea how to beat without doing that. But you can't just build um, guns inside the enemy's bases. At least not until much later in the game. And then I still don't even know if they intended that to happen. But, um, but yeah, bombers are the choice for taking out buildings. They do extra damage, and they generally target buildings. And I've just built a lot of them. I haven't told all of these guys... Oop, that was an interceptor. There we go. So we're, we're, we're bombing them to death. I think they tend to fly towards the the place that you um that you build them closer to, so they're all going for yellow first. Um now am I Yeah, I can't I wouldn't be able to reach any of their guns or, or buildings or anything like that. But there we go. Now the the bombers have overtaken I think, well, there's a, there's a fighter bay, right? Yeah. But they're swarming. And now, since I have so many spawned, they're going to really rush these guys. Already took out one of their guns, took out their main port. Um, bases are also equipped with guns. So this base has two guns. So if you have absolutely no defenses, then you at least have that baseline. <laughs> baseline defense. Bomber. Just going to keep on, well, it doesn't matter anymore. Bomb that last one, we'll get this guy, and then we'll go home. And the the other game had a very slight story. This one's like, eh, the story didn't really matter, did it? So there, there's none of that. <laughs> um, this one will unlock the Destroyer. That unlocked auto guns, the really good close-range rapid-fire shotgun-like gun from the first game. And I should show barricades, probably. There just hasn't been a lot of recourse. Um, you can also pause, just like in the other game, if you want to really, really stick it to people build a whole bunch of things. Uh, Alright, so those guys are really close. Auto gun. Auto gun. Do -do 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 -do. Good. Now I might actually... Yeah, this is a case where I actually can build in there, but it's interesting. That's usually not the case. Um, and it's also just not as necessary, because you can always just build things pretty quick. Um, here are the barricades. So if there was a ship that was shooting long-range missiles, um, the missiles would hit the barricades instead of your weapons. That's all that does. In fact, that gun is now shooting the barricade instead of my gun, which is unwise for him. Um, let's do let's do a variety of things. Get them built first. Choose different ones. And this will I'll finally get a new type of ship um, after completing this mission. All right, easy. And I have the destroyer. And all right, so I've been accruing things for upgrades. I'll, I'll deal with that in a little bit. But now I have my first medium ship, the destroyer. Let me see if I can use that. What is the next most difficult? We got a gunship here, light carrier, uh, light cannon, repair turret. Well, we want this. This is a flank mission. That means that I am surrounding someone else with a different enemy. So yeah, you see me on the bottom. There's also this guy I need to defeat, and this guy. But this guy's, of course, the most screwed because he's in the center. The opposite of this is Pinsir. That's where you're in the center. <laughs> Those are the only differences. But first off, um, well, we want to build this. So I didn't really need to pause there. But then we have the Star Dock. Star Dock makes medium ships. Right now I just have the Destroyer. And I have a little bit of time because he's distracted. But there we go. Made a Destroyer. Let's also make one auto gun. And, uh, maybe one more energy. Yeah. 
So, there we go. That is my destroyer. He's got a bunch of missiles, and he actually just destroyed their base. One of them destroyed their base. That was nice. I think he got a little bit lucky there, but still. Now we'll be making two destroyers. Yeah, that was ridiculous that he was able to do that. Also, that he actually went for the right building. <laughs> Both impressive. Do, 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 do. So yeah, he's got a gun and missiles. They're, they're a good ship. Let's make another. And so next, the destroyer has to go all the way up. These guys are much more um, defended, well defended. And my ships are getting a little bit distracted instead of going for the target I want them to, but you know what happens. Let's uh, make some little fighters to back him up. All right, let's see. You guys getting through? Yep, there goes one gun, two guns. And there's a few of them are still going right for the base without destroying the gun because they're crazy like that. Oh, he survived. Yeah, their defenses are very much so hampered already. I kind of wish I could zoom in. In situations like this, like, get a, get a closer look at the little sprites battling each other. And I do like the mini-map. You get a, a nice little uh, overview of what's happening just by the different colors. So now I have the light carrier. We'll equip that. Now I'll be able to make two different types of ships. So you're allowed to make three different types of small ships, three different medium ships, and three different capital ships. I don't have any capital ships yet. They're the crazy ones. Uh, those starports take up six or nine spaces. It's a little bit... So actually, oh, you can only make two capital ships. Okay. And you can have seven different types of turrets and two different auxiliaries. Let's look at the upgrades real quick. These are all things that will permanently upgrade you for the entire game. You never get rid of them. And you can get all of them eventually. Um, what are some good ones? What should I start out with? Power efficiency. Generators and reactors produce energy faster. I would love to get that first upgrade. So I just need 100 more credits. Um, this will give it to me. It's 99 credits, but I, I have a little bit more than I need for that. So, energy. Looks like there's two guys down there. We're going to make a starport. Or, er, starport. Um, now I need to make some guns really quick, because they, they are attacking me very quickly. There we go. Uh, my starport's almost destroyed. Oh, dear. All right, pause. I clearly, um, clearly got a bit overzealous there. Basic fighter, basic fighter, basic fighter, blaster. Like, let's not lose my base here. It might already be too late. I'm probably going to lose my base. <laughs> this game can get very crazy very quickly. Like, definitely more so than the first game. Um, blaster. Blaster. There goes my energy production. All right. I think, we're, I think we've lost this one. <laughs> if they destroy my base, I've definitely lost. Auto gun. Yeah, I'm being attacked by both sides. So let's just let's just not even. Yep, there it goes. <laughs> I surrendered right before they defeated me. Anyway, all right. This time we're we're not gonna do what I just did for sure. I am gonna build this still, but then we're immediately going to make sure that I'm at least somewhat defended from that crab. Here. Then hopefully they won't be able to overwhelm me. There we go. And let's, as I can, we're going to slowly make uh, basic fighters. They're still overwhelming me. This is this is actually incredible that it's, that it's this difficult this early. Yeah. Okay. Let's try that a third time. <laughs> okay, so this time I'm not going to get a gigantic energy thing. I, I don't think I can afford it. There, boom, boom. Good. They didn't even get past me. That gun took a lot of damage, though. I don't like that. Let's make some long range. All right, it looks like we're uh, outranging that turret a little bit, so that's nice. Here. They started close to me, they did. Um, can I make a bomber? If I get... Oh, God. That, uh, that dock is being pounded already. Already destroyed. Amazing. All right. Yeah, this one's this one's surprisingly difficult for a starting stage. Make another interceptor. Just because like both sides are completely ignoring each other, they're both attacking me, so I'm just getting way more uh, way more than I can handle in general. And because I wasn't able to get a big dock, it's um yeah. 
If I lose again, I'm not doing this one again. I'll go to other stages. And maybe I can even... I don't think they're really shooting missiles at me, though. But yeah, this isn't looking great. Um, I'm not able to get, like, a capital ship to deal with little guys. I, um... Although the barricades does seem to be helping a little bit, because just because it's absorbing shots, like, they're, they're targeting it more than I thought they would. Uh, pause. This is my last, like, desperate attempt here. Alright. No, this isn't working. Alright, they destroyed my base. Wow. This is like the third stage. Okay, so let's not go there yet. Apparently 16 is a little bit rough for me right now. Um, are these all hard? What, which one is this? This is a skirmish. That's defense. Defense is interesting. Let's get. Let's try to do this, even though I'm going to be stuck between two people. Let's see if it's easier. Um, power grid boost. That's amazing. So that means that everyone gets to build things faster. Uh, things can potentially get very crazy very quickly with that. All right, let's build interceptor or uh, fighter bay. Interceptor. There we go. Good. We we held that off nicely. That was destroyed. It's gonna make more and more guns. Let's make some top guns. Yeah, because because of the power grid boost, look what I'm able to do. All right, so hopefully that'll keep them at bay for a little bit, so that I can build this little guy in the side. Cool, and we're gonna make a light carrier, medium warship with small fighters. That should help. And so should those. Uh, my base is almost destroyed though. I need to make sure that like no one gets there. Uh... Oh my god, <laughs> I'm just putting barriers there to distract them. There's my light carrier. I'm pretty well defended from the bottom it looks like. Um, did they destroy- I think they destroyed my reactor, yeah. Oh boy. So I'm- I'm just working off the power boost right now. Uh, my light- my- my carrier's getting through though and actually doing decent damage to the top. And because of that, I'm just gonna make absolutely sure that no one's gonna get through on the bottom. And despite what I said about the guns, it looks like those guns are, uh, we're shooting that building there. <laughs> um, let's make another one of you. Um, oh quick. It looks like- Looks like my base regenerated a little bit or something. I don't know. They have light carriers too now. That's not great. Um, defend, defend. All right. So next I want another star dock. Just need to get to 300. Bam. And then we're going to use a destroyer once I get to 200. Boom. All right. How's top looking? Not great. I don't think they can even... I don't know if they can even produce anything. So ignoring them... Um, next, bombers. Uh, making a whole bunch of bombers can be incredibly effective if you're able to, like, distract the guns or get past the guns. Um, they're not great for combating ships is the thing, so you gotta make sure you're pretty well suited before that. But yeah, now the bombers are already already pressing their guns pretty, pretty rapidly. And unlike the first game, the enemy certainly builds and upgrades and gets better. So, that that's huge. <laughs> that's a gigantic difference right there. All right, bomber. Oh, I can't even reach bomber because I was too far to the other side, but bomber, 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 bomber. All right. The bomber squad is coming. All right, taking that gun and that gun. Each run, they're taking out a gun. That's all I can ask from this. Excellent. And I can fit you in there. Make another light carrier. They're using light carriers against me, too, by the way. And this is it. We took out most of their forward guns. They are done. All right. So I just got the repair turret. Very good thing to have. <laughs> um, so now, power efficiencies. I, I think that's a good one to get first, yeah? Now, am I able to do this one now that I have that? That's the question. Nope, <laughs> was the answer to that. All right, so let's find one that I can do. Uh, these are giving quite the rewards. 
Also, the map that's given is um is randomly generated. It's different each time. All right, so pause. This is a defense map. I just have to hold out. That is the only mission. So put a power generator there. Let's do one, two, three. Okay, and a star deck, which has... I mean, that's all I can afford right now. All right, rock that. Like interceptors. Okay. And repair turrets. So repair turrets will shoot a little repairing laser at any damaged building. And maybe ships too, I don't remember. All right. Auto gun, auto gun, auto gun. All right. Let's make another reactor. And next, we're gunning for a starport. Right here. Starport, there's a big ship. Hopefully that gets taken out. Uh, destroyer. Go! This thing's good for taking out little groups of fighters. Got that. Let's put some barricade distractions here, because sometimes I do just shoot at them. That is a, that is a capital ship. Oh my. A little bit crazy to send that against me. Eh. Auto gun. All right, he's done. We got another one. Let's get a light, light carrier when I can. All right, they're getting a little bit crazy here. Let's put a repair turret by my uh, my generator because if that blows up, I am in trouble instantly. And let's get some interceptors. Don't really need bombers, there's not anything to bomb. Not that they can't fight, it's just, you know, I think even the fighters might be better against ships than bombers. Not sure about that, but that's the assumption. And now I can't really build this in a place that's not exposed, unfortunately, but I'll just build it in a place that's exposed. Another destroyer up. Put a repair turret, because again, it is exposed. And it is almost destroyed. <laughs> I knew that was going to happen. Figured it might be worth it. Here, 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 boom. So that one that is a 16 difficulty, that's certainly a little bit deceiving, isn't it now? Because <laughs> this stage is ridiculous. I don't know why it's that ridiculous, but it certainly is. Um, this thing is better. The, the, the shield generator is a great item. I'm glad that I got it. So where can I use it? that won't be in an embarrassment like that stupid 16 state. That's a pincer. That could be bad. Dual. Dual. Ooh. Fleet carrier. That's a capital ship. Freeze drone. Hmm. Freeze drones are pretty cool. Acid turret. Let's try it. Okay. Pause. Um, we're gonna build this. Then I'm gonna build a shear generator. Maybe a little bit early for that, but I did it. And we're going to build a star dock. Also a little bit early for that, but I did it. One blaster. This might be an incredibly bad build, but we see. You see that blue thing? That is my shield generator. Um, it blocks shots in a circle. Once it gets hit, it takes damage, but uh, then it regenerates. Really great defensive item. All right. We're going to make a light carrier when I can. And fortunately, it looks like the two other factions are fighting against each other. It's not just all of them coming at me like that one stage. Um, repair turret. Because they are getting through. And... Let's do my frontal defense here. Auto cannons. Eh. And I think I want... Another shield generator. They can work in tandem, which is nice. As you can see. See, they just did enough damage to take it out, but you know. Another repair turret. Try to keep my other turret strong. And it's time to get some little fighters out. Alright. Uh, interceptors, go! All those are interceptors, and then we'll make two bombers. Boom. All right, now we should be able to fight back. Because you really do need your ships to fight back in this. Um, I was wrong. Like, it looks like you can use your... In certain circumstances, you can use your guns to do some damage to the base, but you're not going to win like that. Um, you really do need... Uh, 
you need ships to go out and start attacking. And yeah, that that what is what are all these? <laughs> Maybe that's their version of an energy thing. I don't know. Um, oh boy. All right, we need more. We need to build a bunch more. So along here. Let's build a block of nine. All right, and make them uh, make them all bombers. I can't quite afford that. We'll unpause. But as soon as I can afford it, <laughs> we're building them gradually. There we go. My first bombers have been set out. And boom. All of those are bombers now. And they're already doing damage. Alright, so oh god. He just sent some crazy ship after me. Yeah, we're already we're already taking it sticking it to him. Stick it to him, boys. That's boys with a Z. Alright, yellow's gone. Red is almost gone. Oddly enough, the yellow buildings up there are also are, are red according to the map. Acid turret. Never really messed around with acid too much. Um Oh, it's all the way over here. Corrosive acid slowly destroys targets. It's a it's a poison gun. <laughs> I don't know. I, I don't even know if I unlocked that originally because the the order that you get the upgrades are also different. Um, you can also revisit things. So infestion. There are the aliens are in the stage again. They can infest your ships, and that sucks. Then there's shock resistance, acid resistance, freeze resistance, um, missile jamming. Ships are harder, or missiles are harder. Ships are harder for enemies to track with missiles. Gotcha. Still feel like I read that wrong. Um, turret rotation speed increased. I like that one. Um, I want to beat this by the end of the episode. Like it's ridiculous that that one is giving me issues. Also, no, I don't have a capital ship. Okay, that's right. I didn't complete that. So let's see. This is a defense. Freeze drone. Fleet carrier. I would love to get this. Let's see if I can do it. Duel. That means I'm fighting against one other person. So, boom. Boom. Boom, boom. All right. Let's make a simple little fighter here so that I got something. And then as soon as I can... Alright, repair droids. I'm gonna have to repair faster than that. <laughs> um, shield generator. Let's pop this back up. Let's make more repair guys. They just destroyed my shield generator. That's not great. Alright. I do think they're shooting missiles also, though, so we're actually gonna use a bit... Yeah, there's some missiles coming in. Gonna use some old school defenses. Alright, that should be helpful. And we'll back them up with long range. And then we'll shield the barricade with a shield generator. <laughs> yeah, we're starting to tear them up. They're they're gonna start upgrading and stuff though, so I have to be careful, but uh for now it looks like my defense is pretty effective. Now we're shielding my barricade. Now I'm rebarricading my barricade. <laughs> good. All right, we're good for a while. It's time to fight back. Interceptor. 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 Did that last one go off? Yes. Okay. How's their base looking? Their base isn't too crazy. They're just sending a lot of ships at me pretty fast. But I've built a defense that uh, seems to be working because they were using missiles. There we go, little guys are getting through. Also, I should really try out my acid turret. We'll give him a nice little front spot. Uh, I can't defend him in any way, though. Uh, no one's even getting into range. There we go. Uh, well. <laughs> Look, the fact that they're not getting into range is a good thing, I guess. But, okay, acid turrets definitely hit that time. Place another one there. All right. To make a light carrier and a destroyer. And that should really start to punch through their forces. Acid, acid, acid. You know, the acid's actually a little bit better than I thought it was. All right, there we go. We got some of my big ships fighting their big ships. We're still not making any headway though, but that's fine because I haven't yet released the bomber squad. 
Bomber, 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 <laughs> bomber. All right, so the hope is that like my big capital ships will distract their guns. Meanwhile, the little bombers come in and get some shots and doesn't always work out. But it looks like it is more or less working out. There's just too many bombers for them to all deal with. And the amount of time that it takes them to destroy a bomber, they've already taken significant damage, so. They are being pelted. And I would go back to build more, but I want to watch the carnage, guys. I need to. Pew, pew, pew. There we are. Once that goes down, it's all over. They ain't building anything else. Nothing's getting replaced. Bomb a diggity. Actually, there's some, there's a big generator down there blocked by the map. I now have a fleet carrier. A fleet carrier is a capital ship. Launches squadrons of fighters. So this ship will just shoot fighters at other ships. Alright, are we ready to complete the hardest stage in the game? Let's find out. I'm hoping more the fact that there's so many guns will just help, but I don't know. Maybe the ships will, like, spread out their targets a bit more. Alright. And that can heal almost everything. Uh, I mean, they're still getting through. They are still getting through. Like, immediately. Oh, man. Alright, fighter. We just gotta hold out, guys. Yeah, they're still getting through. This is crazy. Auto gun. Small gun to distract from the auto gun getting damaged. They destroyed one of my repair guns already. Oh boy. Another repair gun. Oh, there goes that gun. I'll just keep on replacing it. Okay. <laughs> oh boy. Alright. Um, barricades? Let's see if that helps. At all. Uh, build another one of those. Yeah, they're not getting through to my base this time. So that's good. Um, I still don't have, like, any time to breathe, though. But the barricade is definitely helping. Let's make it there. There, yeah, distract them with the barricade. That's good. Uh, if they upgrade their side, like, tons, though, I mean, they're, they're gonna just roll over me eventually. But I've made a defensive wall, at least. And it seems to be holding for now. So we're getting close to being able to counterattack. And I would love to get some more energy, because it is, it is coming in at a snail's pace right now. Plus, they were using freeze turrets. I think those disable my guns, but now they're hitting the barricade, and the barricades don't get disabled, get disabled by being frozen. If anything, they probably get a little bit stronger. And they've breached my barricade. We can't have that. Fortunately, it's really cheap because it's just random debris that we're going to throw out anyway. <laughs> it's space debris. There we are. Ooh, am I outranging that one? I think I am. Good. Goody, goody, goody. I didn't mean to put that there, but all right. Another generator. Replace the barricades. Okay. Um, so next, I mean, I could try to build a starport, but I just, I'm not making the energy for that. I think we should stick with little ships to try to push back. Maybe some bombers. Not that I'm that confident in the defense that I have, but, you know. Pew, pew, pew. And let's put this here. Shielded barricade technique, go. Let's put that there. Okay. Let's make more, I don't know, interceptors. Oh boy. I gotta just keep on keep on working away on my defense over here, though. They keep on breaching it. <laughs> How about this? Take you longer to destroy all that. Can we make a starport? Can we breathe long enough to make a starport? I don't think we're gonna breathe long enough to make a capital ship, but the fact that I need to on this stage, like this is this is not a 16 difficulty. This is way higher. 
Alright, but now we're making destroyers. That should help. Like, oh god, they're just pelting my defense over here anyway. Even though it's a shielded barricade. But we'll just keep on making it thicker. I don't know how much uh, my, my corrosive shot thing is going to do against uh, small ships, really. That's more of a big ship thing, but good. We're, we're, we've, we're making a stand. <laughs> Alright, so I've just let the game run for a long time, constantly repairing, repairing my defenses, just so I could do this. I figure, might as well try to finish this stage with a bang. Um, Blue has been hurt a lot just due to constantly being hit by my little ships, and unfortunately I need to... If that barricade can fall, that means the rest of it can fall. I do have to keep that up. But all right, we're starting to build a capital ship. Notice how long it's taking. Um, this need that 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 bar needs to fill all the way up for it to launch. But hopefully, it'll make a nice showing instead of getting destroyed instantly. But <laughs> I don't know. We'll see. And boom! Like I could, if I wasn't just waiting on this, I could have finished the stage faster for sure. Here he goes. And there, just launched a whole bunch of fighters against the enemy, and they did, in fact, destroy some stuff. More fighters! Yeah, the, yeah. <laughs> and then it also has lasers. And it's not even really being hit, because the, the guns are all trying to take out the fighters. Oh boy, yeah, that was like the... <laughs> that was crazy. <laughs> Well-earned gunship. Um, here's my gunship. So, in order to use my gunship, I need to get rid of something else. So, this is designed to take out medium ships. Very useful in certain situations. Um, I'm gonna... I am gonna get rid of the basic fighters for it. That can be a little bit dangerous, because I can't make a whole bunch of little fighters, but I've already gone beyond the point of doing that anyway. I think we're gonna try to do one more. In this amount of time, it would have been nice to do even more, but... Alright, let's try a pincer. Um, warning, heat damage. Now, let's see here. Energy structure effects. What is heat damage? I don't remember. Okay, um, this is what it is. It, we're close to a star. Buildings will take damage automatically unless they're repaired. So I need to, I need to take that into account pretty much immediately. We'll build this. Hopefully it's not a mistake. That we I am surrounded by a gun right there, so that's not okay. We're going to blow that up. See, they're trying to do the technique of building too close to me because they're jerks. Uh, we'll also do it to there. All right, that's all of my energy. Let's see how this goes. Uh, good. Got rid of that gun. Got rid of that gun because you're a jerk, and that was a jerk move to do. Um, another repair turret. And fighters will die very quickly, so I'm not even going to build the little fighters. Um, that will also affect my enemies, too, though, so. Yeah, the fighters are getting torn up pretty quickly. Um, Starduck. Should be fine for medium ships, though. And I'm, I'm undefended from that side, but at least we can start building that. I need to very quickly start. Let's start making these. That'll help for a little bit, at least. Alright, until I can get my destroyer up. Yeah, let's just build these. <laughs> okay. And yeah, everything's taking damage, so even my blasters are taking damage. We need more repairs. I mean, the, the repair gun's like barely negating the damage that everything else is taking, so I just need a lot of them. But fortunately, the enemy's just using little ships, <laughs> so that should help. Uh, that should help with me, with my big ships. Here. Okay. We are surviving. And something just blew up without being attacked. <laughs> so. Yeah. In fact, yellow's doing very badly. They're not building the correct type of ships. And. That gun's about to explode due to its own device. Oh, Alright, he finished it off. Yellow's done. Uh, this side is done too. They're, they're not repairing their thing. I mean, this is basically auto-win if you just hold out, because they don't, they're not making repair guns. Also, I don't know how you're going to win this if you don't have repair guns unlocked yet. <laughs> so that's another factor. But I did. So I'm winning. Also, this asteroid is a physical thing. It is, it is blocking my missiles. <laughs> Alright, rockets. 
But I think that's it. I mean, in a way, I should have ended it after, um... After the, the first one, be, or the last mission, because that was that was clearly the boss of the game. Let me just get an upgrade really quick for... Ah, I'll decide that next time, actually. So, this was the first episode of Destroy Everything 2. Try it out for free. I just punched my microphone. Um, <laughs> try it out for free. Just like all the other Flash games that I play on my Flash game list, which should be there. I'm probably... I may have already migrated this to its separate Destroy Everything series playlist instead of my Flash game playlist, but I have the Flash game playlist. I got this playlist for Destroy Everything games. I still haven't decided if I'm doing Obliterate... I'm saying Destroy Everything, and it's Obliterate Everything. Obliterate Everything 3, I have not played yet. I will probably play it after this. We'll see. <laughs> but, um... Yeah, that's that. I've got a lot more to go. It's gonna be a long journey. But... Shouldn't be more than four episode journey. <laughs> so, I'll hopefully see you then. Thank you very much for watching. Thanks as always to my patrons for supporting the channel. And I'll see you guys next thing. Is we obliterate more all things. <laughs>